by Sally Grindley and Peter Hutton. Shh. Shh. Be quiet. Shh. You are about to enter a giant's castle. Come inside. Now, you must be quiet. The giant will cook you for his tea if he catches you. Let's look at the next page. Shh. <gasps> look, there's the giant's pet mouse. Shh. If we wake him up, he might run and tell the giant. <gasps> Turn over quickly now, in case he hears us. And there's the giant's cat. Shh. Let's go past very quickly, in case we wake her up. I think I heard a meow. <gasps> look through that door. And see if she's still asleep. She is. Good. Be quiet again now. If you don't whisper, you'll disturb the giant's hen who's busy laying eggs just over the page. Look, there she is. Shh. If we disturb her, she'll stop laying eggs and run and tell the giant. Turn over quickly now in case she hears us. Do you think we disturbed her? Peep through the peephole and see if she's still there. She is good. Be quiet again now. If you don't talk in whispers, you'll bother the giant's wife, who's busy cooking his dinner, on the next page. <gasps> Look, there she is. Shh. If she sees us here, she'll stop cooking the dinner and run and tell the giant. Turn over quickly now. In case she hears us. Do you think she saw us? Look through the door and see if she's still cooking dinner. She is. Good. Be quiet again now. If you don't whisper, you'll wake the enormous giant who's snoring on the very next page. There he is. Isn't he ugly? Listen to that snore. I dare you to say, boo. <gasps> Quick, turn the page in case he heard us. Do you think we woke him up? Peek through the hatch and see if he's still asleep. He's awake. Are you sure? Quick, turn the page before he comes after us. Quick, he's coming. Shut the book.